I'm going to be talking about this farm behind us in a little bit. We're coming to you from Amman, Jordan. Um, and this is the number two water pork country in the world. And so aquaponics is actually perfect for that. And so we're going to talk about how uh, technology has helped liberating communities out here in Jordan. And uh, let's go check out this farm and see what's going on. So let's just chat this out. So this is the farm. Um, it has about 300 heads of lettuce and it has about, you know, 40, 50 fish. And this is a rooftop system on a, a center for a youth with disabilities. So there's a bunch of kids here that come up here and harvest and they're learning job skills. But one of the big issues that they were encountering was how do I actually get started and how do I get these students up and running quickly? And so you'll notice when you come into the actual area, you can just pull out your smartphone and you'll start to see a list of all the things that you have to do that day. Um, it's scheduled out, it's, it's set up by someone like a farm manager and it's in Arabic so it's available to them in their own language and they know exactly what to do. So they just pull out their phones, go through and tap the little check boxes and then they know that they're done for the rest of the day. Farm manager also has like a benefit of knowing who did what when so they know fish were fed by this person or you know someone didn't check the, the, the pests or the IPM plan or something like that. So they have a full insight into the system without actually having to come every day and to look at it. Uh, we do promote BRICS testing. And so one of the things that the students do here is they do some BRICS tests. They grab some of their, their leafy greens and they put a little drop on there and they do the test of BRICS. And they, that gives them a number uh, that shows them how well or how much uh, you know stuff is in the plant. And basically what happens is they go on their phone, they enter it, and they can see directly uh, the range in where it's supposed to be, whether it's low or high, and it notifies the farm manager should anything be too low um, and they need to do some adjustments in the system. So after the students are done harvesting, uh, they'll actually take these you know, big sheets of lettuce over there and take them out and harvest them and put them and sell them or give them away. And then they'll, they'll actually record how much was harvested and that was done directly on the app. Everything is done on the app for them. And we even have like a little tablet that sits here. And if someone doesn't have a phone at the time, they just open up the tablet and it's right where they left off. They know who's doing what. And so it's very simple for them to know exactly what they need to be doing, how much is being harvested, how much is being lost in the harvest and things like that. So you can see here, we actually have an Atlas Scientific uh, sensor and it's just, just a basic hydro kit, um, hydro Wi-Fi kit. And we have a co-generator you just hit install uh, and it shows you exactly how to put it onto the, the sensor itself and it starts sending data to the cloud where you could hook up notifications and all sorts of stuff to it. Uh, we do have another sensor from a third party vendor. This one is from Vika One and they're, they're designing their sensors to be uh, easily obtainable for uh, like developing contexts and people who have low internet solutions. And so they have certain parameters that they're tracking and it lets us do our more environmental stuff like uh, temperature, humidity, that kind of thing. And there's lots of sensors going out here and it actually goes to their system, but we use our tool called Sparky to relay that data as well to our system as well. Um, and then you could also hook up all your stuff to like sensors and notifications and things like that to your system. Um, and so now these sensors work together and they give us a full spectrum kind of view of what's going on in the system. Uh, but not just that, we have custom tools to build your own sensor. So if you have the, the technical ability to go out and buy a Raspberry Pi or something, you could actually hook up a sensor to your system and just in a line or two of code, uh, directly start relaying your data to the cloud. So there's a lot of features uh, that we've been kind of laying out here, but I think one of the, the main things that we want to communicate is that we're actually trying to consolidate all of these different sources of information. So we have you know, we have this, this Wi-Fi uh, hydro kit from Atlas Scientific. We have this Vika One sensor from a German company. Uh, we have BRICS testing. We have the, the actual um, API water test kit. All of that data used to be so sporadic and you try and write it down on paper, but now you could actually consolidate it directly on your phone. Notifications, errors, alerts, all that gets distributed as needed. So it, it gives everyone a fuller picture of what's going on that I mean you could record harvest you could record um, your environmental information you could record you know basically anything people are doing the light spectrum analysis and all sorts of stuff so um, this is a this is a great tool to help you 
get a fuller understanding of what's going on in your farm and how to expand your farm ops and to onboard new employees that are working for you now or to kind of have that peace of mind as a farm manager that you know what's going on in your farm. Um, we now have a marketplace where you can go and you can purchase insights, SOPs, uh, plant profiles, fish profiles. Uh, you could even set up lab tests with recommended labs and, and very uh, prominent labs in the industry. And you could get your system up and running in five minutes, honestly. And that gives you insights from the leading experts in the aquaponics industry uh, and their recommendations for how to grow crops, how to grow fish, and how to run your system and even how to maintain your system once your system is running with lab tests and things like that. And so this is a valuable resource that, that can be tapped into uh, for a low cost. It's only starting at $11.99 a month and you can start growing your farm and making a more uh, sustainable living for you and your family, or you could be doing it at a commercial scale and really reaching customers well and expanding your operations. So we look forward to seeing what you do with that um, and to see how it can empower you um, on your journey to impact your community.